Okay, this video is on tendonitis, guys, tendinopathies, um, you know, whatever stage you're at. Let's just establish one thing. Any form of injury like that has got to do with tension, okay? It is also based around the tendon, and that's where it gets its name from, okay? So we'll talk about the most common ones, and especially the most common mistake. How many out there are, are working on an Achilles tendinopathy injury? You're going around doing eccentric calf raises. You are, you know, you're, you're focusing obsessing around this ankle, this joint, okay? You're focusing on shockwave therapy, dry needling. You've been getting thousands of rubs. You, get, you, you do notice, you know, a little alleviate, a bit of relief, okay? You may be getting work on the sole of the foot and so on, okay? All the guys that you'll see and the girls on our website that would have been going through, you know, this type of an injury, we have to physically follow that chain up. When you, when you have it in the Achilles in particular, especially the hamstring, 100% of the time for the guys and girls that we've fixed, again, it is from that lengthened, over lengthened tissue. So in the body you have the shortening tissue, okay, the muscle spindle essentially is like a train of a carriage. It's supposed to sit just nicely. When you start to have trigger points that start to contract, so let's say for example, on the posterior chain, okay, we develop a massive trigger point in the pec, for example, or in the front delt, maybe in the SCM muscle. That starts to contract and shorten and it wants to pull all the tissue. By the shoulder internally rotating, we now have an issue in the posterior chain, which is exactly where you're complaining of, your Achilles tendinopathy. Okay, so focusing on this, I can promise you is not going to be the reason. 90% of the time, we end up focusing on the complete other limb. We make sure the SI joints are functioning right to get, and especially the two shoulders become fully rotated, that there is no tension traveling down the body. That goes, everything I've just said, also goes for the hamstring tendinopathy that people are getting, okay? This pulling off the tendon bone. We're getting injections, we're getting shockwave therapy, we're getting lots of heavy rubbing, and you forget too that all that heavy rubbing, guys, is gonna break down a massive amount of tissue, but it also breaks down a lot of muscle. And then we end up with, a, with actually a weak hamstring. So again, check out the website, get in contact if you're absolutely crippled with these tendinopathy injuries. I can promise you we'll put it to, be put it to bed for you and we'll find the real reason. A couple of county players we've even, to finish on, we've actually had to fix c naught, okay? And these two guys here, okay? When we fixed them, the Achilles was completely gone. There was no problems anymore. And the very same with the hamstring injuries.